um, we have um, the Soviet Russian Luna 3, which on October the 7th, 1959, uh, supposedly uh, took the first images of the hidden side of the moon. Now, with this in particular, what we actually have here, of course, it uh, uh, doesn't really show too much detail. Um, the reason being is uh, that was given that um, it was a lot of light um, was coming from the sun, supposedly, and, and it just didn't show up enough detail. But um, what we'll actually find is um, these are actually models that uh, the Soviet Russians used to fake all the uh, the images of supposedly setting craft to uh, view the moon and also land on the moon, lunar landers. Um, so that's Luna 3, October the 7th, 1959, supposedly the, the first image of the backside of the moon. And this one here is Zond 3, July the 20th, 1965. It was supposedly the second spacecraft to view the far side of the moon. And what you actually find with this one in particular is um, we've got the, the leg um, of the Zond 3, which you can actually see uh, that um, this leg is actually quite close to this model moon because you can actually see the shadow of it outlined here underneath it quite clearly. So that's um, pretty much just showing that it is a, a model moon and um, how all these uh, things sort of uh, give it away, as it were. And what we also have up here, what they've actually done with this model moon for some reason is they've actually got like a paper or cardboard patch which we've actually put up here and you actually see it lifted up on the sides here. They obviously haven't been too good in creating these models for whatever reasons or they initially... Um, uh, put all these little things in here that maybe people could pick up on and actually see what they've done in faking these uh, photos in particular. And this one here is on 3 July the 29th, That's the square piece of paper and loosely attached to the model moon that you can actually see up here. So it's quite square. And uh, what, what NASA have actually done when they actually were faking the um, moon photos as well, they've actually taken the, the sort of the slight representation of what uh, Russians did and they've actually improved on them in the better quality uh, models that NASA used. And obviously they've kept this little bit of a shape and some sort of semblance up the top of their, uh, their fake model moons um, showing the backside of the moon or faking the backside of the moon as well. It's pretty much like they uh, had a, a bit of upmanship. Um, they were playing with off each other, as it were, and the, the, both of the sides faking all these images. And there's their leg there, Zon 3. Um, as you can see there, it's quite close to this uh, model moon, fake model moon, and you actually see the shadow quite dark there, virtually almost touching the model moon. And this one here is another photo there, on 3, 1965, and you see the same thing. You've got the dark shadow there with a model um, a spacecraft leg being quite close to the model moon, and of course it's a very dark square patch up the top there that you can see as well. It's quite dark. And there's the patch there again. You actually see it being lifted up slightly on the sides. And they've got another little patch up here as well, cardboard patch, something, some sort, paper or cardboard. And this one here is on three. You can actually see a bolt with a washer underneath it. It's right over here. There we go. You see the bolt outline, and you got the washer right underneath it. Now this uh, is on three again. Large square dark patch up the top is lifting up in the corners. You can actually see it up here. I'll just bring it up closer. You can actually see it there. It's actually uh, lifting up slightly on the corners. It's quite clearly a square patch that's been put on there, and there's another patch up here, and that bit's lifted up there as well on that photo. Now this is uh, Luna 9, February the 3rd, 1966, supposedly the first moon landing. But what we actually find in this Soviet-Russian photo, in particular over here, they put some quirky things in there, like uh, Disneyland did in the um, faking of the NASA Apollo moon landing photos. They've actually uh, put a lot of quirky things in there, and the Soviet Russians have done the same sort of thing in their photos as well. We actually find here Luna 9, uh, little stuffed toy aliens lying on the ground. You've actually got some uh, little stuffed toys lying around here, and you've got one right in the front here, very clearly seen. I'll just bring that one up closer. A little stuffed toy alien. As you see the shape of it there, and they've got like two little cut out eyes, as it were, and a little mouth. Just obviously being playful and showing these things in 
are very clearly seen in these photos if anyone had actually studied them properly. And this one, Lunar 9 again, and we actually have in this one uh, panorama uh, photos that they've done here. Which we've got a cat that's shown in the background right over here. Let's take a closer look at that one. So Lunar 9, a cat is in the background. You should see a line there. It's got your ears there. This one here, another ear. Little cat face. It's just a line over there. And we have another photo here again, but the cat is actually walking towards the camera right there. As you can see here, how the cat is lying down there, and then it's started walking towards the camera just over here. And I'll go in closer on that one for you. You can see it there. It's the head of the cat, its body, its little legs, and you see its tail there, just walking towards the camera. This one here is Luna 13, December the 24th, 1966, supposedly made the second Soviet landing on the moon. And in this one we can actually see plants with leaves right in the centre of this photo here. Let's just make that a bit bigger. You actually see leaves on this side here. And also there's one very distinctive uh, plant over here and you see the big leaf there very clearly. And another leaf over here, another leaf there, very clearly seen right in the centre of that photo.